Hi there, guys. My name is Alexander. I'm a Cosmos Sky representative. I've been helping people choose the right tangitron for some years so far. So I've already helped more than like 2,000 people. I can say that I'm pretty experienced to make this video and explain how to choose your first tangitron. Let's start choosing a tank drum according to three main things. Tank drum size, its tuning, and design. The harder thing is tuning choice, but we'll deal with it a bit later. Well, to begin with, you should choose a suitable size. Don't forget that the size influences on the sound depth. Bigger tank drums sound really deep, like bridge bass, for instance, so their sound is the most binaural. Smaller tank drums sound more ringing or vibrant. Let me demonstrate it. That was a small tank drum of 22 cm. Now let's have a look at a double-sided tank drum of 35 cm. While playing with sticks, the sound becomes even more intense. First of all, tank drum size contributes to the sound depth. But secondly, don't forget about tank drum weight. The more steel a tank drum has, the heavier it is. Tank drums of 22 cm weigh approximately 2 kilos. Tank drums of 30 cm weigh about 4 kilos, and those of 35 cm about 5.5 or 6 kilos. If you need a tank drum for some home meditations, some get-together or something else, when it's located at the same place most of the time, you can obviously choose 35 or 30 centimeters if it suits you. But if you are a traveler, a wanderlust person, and you want to take your tank drum with you to play outside, you should choose a 22 or 30 cm model, as they are the fittest. If it's a tank drum of 35 cm or more, you won't get far, I know. Tank drums of 22 cm are always one-sided, so the tons are only on the front side, on the top side. There is a resonating hole on the bottom side. Bigger tank drums can be double-sided. I mean, it can have one kind of tuning on the front side and the other on the bottom side. Two different tunings meant two different moods. It sounds more exciting and versatile or flexible. If your tank drum is one-sided and its tuning is melancholic, you'll be very able to cheer up. The second issue now. Well, imagine that you've already chosen a suitable size. Then you should choose tuning. Most people find it really challenging, as we have plenty of tuning modes. Some of them are for smaller tank drums, some are for the bigger ones, so it can make you feel confused. All you need to know is three key points again. Well, not really three in fact, but you can use three techniques or let me call them ways. Let's start with the easiest one, with the first one we always recommend to our customers. Just listen to all the tunings we have. It should be done by everyone, as it's highly likely that you'll be attracted to a particular tuning mode. In most cases, it really happens like that. But don't forget that when choosing a tuning mode, you do it here and now at the moment. 
So you can have a particular mood if you are at work, for instance, and you feel like a bit down or you don't like your job, there is a high probability, it's highly likely that you'll choose a tuning mode according to your mood. And then when you come back home and start playing the tank drum with such tuning, you can get the same state. It's not a must, but it can happen. So it's better to choose a tank drum in comfortable conditions, probably at home when you are not overexcited or gloomy or angry. The second way now, if you have listened to all tuning modes and you like all of them, which also happens rather often, you can divide them into some moods, yeah, let them call like that. So the first one is a positive mood, positive sounding tuning. It comprises pigment tuning based on C minor scale and F sharp major tuning. Just don't stick to the scale itself. It can be like based on minor scale and sound positive, or vice versa, it can be based on major scale and sound soothing, because not all the notes can be included in the scale. We can sometimes exclude half tones, small intervals, and so on. So, it all depends on us, on the way we make a tank drum. Take into consideration the tuning name, its features and peculiarities. So, the positive one is F-sharp major and pygmy. We also have meditative and soothing tuning modes. First of all, it comprises insomnia tuning. C minor tuning. Basically, you can choose any tank drum for meditation, any tuning. It'll make you feel relaxed and never angry or full of rage, you know. It's just impossible because a tank drum is a peaceful instrument. As for insomnia tuning, it makes people relaxed in its best way, regardless of its name. On the contrary, it will soothe you to sleep, and it's probably suitable even for kids who just don't want to go to bed. We normally recommend this tuning for yoga nidra practice, meditations, shavasana practice, because people can easily relax when applying this tuning mode. Another tuning mode can be called mystical. They include astral, ikebano, and mystic. The last one is quite obvious, you know. These modes sound a bit mysterious due to the combination of particular notes. They have some mystical tunes, vibes in their sound, and they're awesome. The next tuning group can be called neutral, as the modes here don't have any prominent sound like mystical or positive or soothing. Among them, I can specify silent, golden gate, natural AM, C major, DM pentatonic, so that's it. As I've just mentioned, such modes don't have any specific mood, but anyway, they can always show you up and you won't be plunged into some profound thoughts, but, well, never mind. Suppose that you've listened to all the tunings, liked or disliked something, applied my algorithm, my scheme mentioned above, and still think you can't choose anything and won't even be able to play, so you start doubting about your musical abilities and think a tank drum is not for you, I should say it's wrong. Thus, absolutely everyone can play the tank drum. Everybody who touches it can produce harmonious sounds.
So you see the music is created almost by air. When you make a movement like that, so we offer pentatonic scale tuning for such doubtful people. They are based on the pentatonic scale where two notes are excluded and they can contribute to your improvisation. You can constantly play just five same notes but with different octaves. Uh, so a pentatonic scale is the best solution for beginners and amateur improvisers. So you can bang or repeat any times and like the sound, still like the sound. You'll like what comes out. Pentatonic scale is for everyone, for kids and adults. So I guess I've already simplified your tuning choice and uh, mentioned everything. Now let's speak about design, now a third issue. I think it's the least challenging issue. So, your decision will be made much faster. As for design, we can offer tank drums with engravings. Well, all the tank drums here have engravings, including the one outside the camera view. So, I can't show you a tank drum with no engravings so far. <laughs> You can choose any design pattern, but first, you should know if you want a tank drum with or without engravings. Tank drums with no engravings are cheaper, but don't think a tank drum without engravings doesn't look good. It can be just stunning or even breathtaking. Just believe me, our craftsmen can make a real wonder. They can create some lovely hatching or polish, so it usually looks amazing. And it's done after heat processing. Well, you know, I'm going to tell you about it soon. You know, we have a variety of different sketches in our database. If you like one of them, just order it. And uh, if you have your own idea in this respect, feel free to contact us, because we never charge your extra fees for that. Just contact us, contact our designer, and uh, our designer will deal with your own sketch complying with all your needs and all your ideas. So, after having chosen the engravings, the size and the tuning, you should choose the coating, in other words, the color. A tank drum can be processed by use of steel blowing techniques. It means that a tank drum is covered in oil before heat processing. As a result, we have a tank drum with such a beautiful brownish gold color because the, the oil has been baked. Blue wind gave such shades to it. We also have zinc coated tank drums, that's our innovation. The coating is light yellow with some bloomy shade, the grain bluey shade. It perfectly protects the tank drum from rust and corrosion, and is more shock resistant compared to the other coatings. And it's just wonderful. We also have coating based on anilin. It gives blue and purple shades to a tank drum. It's sometimes difficult or hard to see them in artificial light, under the lights, for instance. So they are clearly seen when the weather is a bit cloudy or overcast. Anilin is like blue wing. It's heat processing, but this time we don't apply oil. And tank drum is glazed, all our tank drums are glazed, by the way, to protect them from rust and corrosion. As we're constantly developing our techniques, we're always trying to find new ways of steel processing. For beginners exclusively, we supply each tank drum with a pair of sticks. And uh, such a nice bag. For the moment, we have only two variants, so that's like a lottery, a surprise for you guys. You never know what you're going to get. 
But in any way, you can enjoy Cosmos Sky Tank drums because that's always amazing. Overall, that was all I wanted to tell you guys. He was Alexander, Cosmos K Company. I was really glad to clarify all the details for you guys. Thank you. Bye.